Alrighty, welcome back to another episode of Airline Empires. You can see this is the main screen. You can see I uploaded our logo and everything for Fresh Airways. Hope you guys like it. You can see there's 276 people now. I have no idea what there were last episode. But you can see our daily operating profits are down to 136.3 or 136,000. We were at 156. And you can see our cash has gone down considerably. We had 5 million. We now have 2. So if we enter the world, we can see what exactly is going wrong. So let's go to routes. Boom, we can see which one was hit. The Our most profitable one, the one with just that as competition, his price is the same as ours. Wow, way to match. What'll, what will 300 give us? Ooh, let's try 325, still 100. Yeah, how about 340? That's $15 cheaper. Nope, how about 335? This game is really fun though, with the whole managing of your own airline and stuff. You can see we now own 53% of this market, and our plane is filled 100% full. The demand is 145. You know, I think we can add another flight. Let's add one more. Add flights. Now we should, hold on, let's see, we have 136, there's 145 available, so we're looking good. We, we, you can see we now own 72% of the market. So if we go to routes, all the others have changed the same, and we're now up to 159 versus 156, which is where we were before. Let's take a look at our finances. You can see February, we lost 4 million. March, we lost 1.2. April, we lost 1.4. And so far this month, we're gaining 1.7. So let's see what our big, biggest expense was and see how we can minimize that. Gate lease payments. Hmm. Here, let's look at our gates. This is our gates, right? Yeah, all right, so we own... Wow. We only own one? Because for one, we own more, but... All right, return gates. How many gates? All right, I do not have any open slots. All right, so we can't minimize that. Uh, fuel, that's something that we really can't handle. What is this? Aircraft maintenance, ton of money. Wow, ticket sales. I think we just need to make more in ticket sales. We have nearly, a, yeah, a quarter million dollars in in-flight services so that's pretty good so I think we just need to add more flights see if we can lease an aircraft wait hold on Let, let's look at our aircraft that we have now and see how many hours two wow so we can add next to nothing with that let's look at the used aircraft Ooh, DH7 that's a nice guy hmm Let's take a look. Let's close that. Uh, lease price monthly is another 181000 I think he could pay for itself. He is a little bit old. All of these guys are way more expensive. How many people can he hold? Ooh, wow, he's much bigger. No wonder why. Uh, current backlog is only one. Number of seats, 65. Wow, so yeah, that can go quite a few places. We can lease, I don't know, two of those maybe? Um, I don't know, I kind of want to stay small though, because, you know, there really aren't many places. Oh my goodness, I don't know. Let's look at the new aircraft. It's going to cost us more to lease, but... Alright, which one? I like the... I'll see it when I know, or I'll know it when I see it. Metro 3, that was the guy that I liked. He has 19 seats. How much was he to lease? Metro, 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 where are you? Here you are. You are 88,000. Wow, that's not bad at all. Like, at all. How many seats does he have? Metro has 19. That's pretty good, because you can see this 21-seater has 111,000 for the monthly lease. 
Ooh, here's 18 though for 77. What does he look like? Yeah, too small. I know, it's only one seat less, but I mean, he just looks too small. Uh, what's another good option? I'm looking at the seat numbers in case you're wondering. You guys can as look at this as well. We got 87, way too small. 20, AN 28. Ooh, yuck, yuck. Ugh. Um, any available for pre-order? 380 seats, heck no. 37, let's see what he looks like. No image. All right, not getting you then. Sorry. No, I'm not sorry, just no. Just no, 400 seats. Wow, he is big. That is one big jet. 380, ooh, 37, already looked at him. 400, 155, and then 120, sweet. So the only really new ones have way too many seats. This is a very critical part in uh, deciding. Here, what kind of aircraft? We have the 737-200, don't we? Right here. Monthly lease of nearly half a million dollars. Ooh. Yuck. We could, but you know what? Why not? Why not? Boeing 737-200 lease. Uh, which one adjusted lease? I want the cheapest. 449. Yes, you. And then the range is 1965. Wow, the best out of all of them. So yeah, we're gonna take that guy. One, seriously, that's the most we can do. Default, one, still, negotiate. 2.3 is due right now. We have 2.2. So yeah, we're gonna have to take out a bond. Let's go to bonds. Let's take out one five million issue. Uh, I agree. Annual interest, 14.3. Monthly interest is 50,000, 60,000. And our credit rating is now a B. But we now have, watch this, 7.2 million. So let's go to the 737-200 lease here. Select for over 10 years with that, negotiate. 8.9, can't do that, how about three? Negotiate 6.7. We can do that. Let's confirm that lease. All right, so we now have three new 737 200s coming at our way. Coming at our way, I don't know what I'm saying. We only have half a million dollars though in the bank. Seems like a lot, but it really isn't. Order books, no pending deliveries. Here we are. You can see when they're going to be delivered. We got June 18th, it's May 14th, June 8th, yeah, and then July 22nd. Or July 8th and July 22nd. So it's all looking pretty good. Nothing really that we can do right now. I mean, we fixed our routes. So that's all looking good. We got airplanes on the way. Let's take a look at our route map. Boom! That's us right there. Right there. Then if we go to... Let's look at routes. Then let's manage that competition let's click on this boom this is our I don't know what you call it this is our airline there's our logo this is supposed to be a livery like you know the painting on a plane but I don't know how to do that so this is it for now this is just a larger logo with some cool things in the background aircraft type we only own Boeing 737 200s we have a fleet size of one uno Three of them are on order. And here's where we fly. We fly to Phoenix Mesa, Denver, LA, Chicago, Seattle, and Salt Lake. Utilization is quite low, even in Phoenix Mesa, but. So yeah, you can see our um, um, description here. Not quite sure where the slogan pops up, but yeah. This is our airline. Let's take a look and see what else we can do. We could add like first class and stuff to the Boeings, but we're kind of this low fare carrier. So I think we're gonna maintain what we're doing. Look at that, our airline reputation now is above 6%. It's at 44%, so that's pretty good. Let's, can, let's look at finance again, income statement. What was another large expense? 
Landing fees, nearly 100,000. Aircraft lease payments, of course, is gonna put us under this month. Um, ooh, wow. Quite a bit, we're spending quite a bit on cabin crew. All right, let's see if we can change that a little bit. Uh, options, I think is where we're going. Human resources. What, 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 what are we doing? Oh, cabin crew, here we are. 20, you may make 15. So we're at 692, save 629. Wow, that saved us quite a bit of money. You're not exactly red, so you're gonna be changed to eight. You're gonna be changed to 15. You're gonna be changed to 12. Now we're at 629.6. Now we're at 603. And we still have a little bit of wiggle room on these three, so. We might go a little bit lower than that, but shared control, already went over that. Marketing, I don't think that's gonna help us right now. It'll cost more than what it'll give us. And reputations going up. Financial health, 100%. However, if our income goes negative, passengers will lose confidence in our airline's longevity. Maintain a positive cash balance and this rating will grow automatically. Average fleet age, about 90%. 90%. We're at 3.25. Age of the airline, 18%. We haven't been around very long. The older we get, the higher that'll go. Route reputation, 47% with a weight of 40. This rating comes with your reputation on routes you fly. Factors include on-time performance, in-flight service, frequency of flights, etc. So basically, the more frequent we go, the better it'll be. Because... That's why I kind of wanted to go smaller, but you know, I think it'll be okay for now. Size is only 3%. Completely understandable. Details. Oh wow, I could have just clicked on that. History. Let's see what our history looks like. Wow. What is this? Value. Alright, so our cash value was at 3.3. .3. Then it went down to 2 million for cash value. And then down to 0.6. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. Uh, profit apparently hasn't kicked in yet. And bank, or rank, has been going down slightly. But that's okay. I do believe that is. Here, there should be a way to, um, alliance options, where we can start or join an alliance. Hold on, let me go back to where we were. History. I saw something else. Routes and passengers. Passengers has been going down? February, March, April. On Tuesday, March 1st, we had 1,044. And on Sunday, May 1st, we had 933. Oh, I think that was because of the price change. Aircraft. I think it was just age and stuff. Qual quantity, fleet age, and fleet utilization. Reputation. Not quite sure what the difference is. Oh, here we are. What is that red color? That's amazing. Financial health going way up. No, that's a 60 million. Financial health should be at 100. One of these should be. But it's not. See, look, 100. But none of those, okay. Oh no, yeah, financial health, 100. Yes, that's what I like to see. Um, home. Let's go home. And then let's, there should, ah, oh, yeah, right here, rankings. You can see our rankings among other airlines in this game. Look at this, $94 billion, Aero Brazil. Mad Paradise, $69 billion. That is just way, way a lot of money. And to think we're gonna become the best, you can see their reputation, destinations, just a ton. This guy has 246 destinations with a fleet of 721. And yet he's number one and he has so many aircraft, so little destinations, that's surprising. And you can see this guy, 375, a fleet of 1,055. Wow. Uh, we can search, let's look up fresh. Boom, here we are, We get, there's fresh air and fresh airways. We are a little bit below fresh air because I think fresh air just got started because they have the minimum or the uh, amount of money that they start out with. But you can see we have a destination of six, daily flights of eight, 933 daily passengers, and we fly 6,300 
and 27 miles daily. So yeah, I think we're doing pretty good. But anyways, I mean, we got we got our aircraft on order. We got our routes all fixed up. Because, I mean, that'll change on a daily basis. And I might make one on a daily basis. I might not. So until next time, I thank you guys for watching. And tune in next time. Thank <laughs> you.